Hello everyone and coming to you today from the largest stadium in the Balearic Islands, the Visit Mallorca Estadi. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And a potentially exciting occasion on the cup front. It's Mallorca up against Real Betis. Well, there's nothing like a good cut run to boost confidence. And these two teams will be hoping this could be their year to win this tournament. Yes, there's a long way to go, but this is still a big game for both teams. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. The goalkeeper of choice is Sergio Rico. Palme Costa starts with Pablo Maffeo in the fullback positions. And the striker for this match is Angel. Well, here's the Betis starting 11. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. You would think a strong possibility of a red card. Let's see. And the referee does send him off. No arguments there. Well, no complaints really, but they need to reorganise now and quickly. And he's made headway. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Well, the counter chance looks very real. A real opening now. Surely... Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. Getting forward. Real chance. And a goal! The equaliser! They simply refuse to be beaten. Down to ten men right back in this game well it's a goal you'd expect him to score but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely he'll be happy with that A really sumptuous ball, and he might be in here. And a goal! In the lead again, fully deserved! Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. At some point, they have to threaten the space in behind the defenders. Otherwise, they're going to lose this. And he's in.
Well, I won't get tired of watching this. It's an outstanding bit of play. Just look how far he runs with the ball. That's a great goal. So almost at full time. Oh, he's and through on goal here, Derek. Surely. And it goes. Well, it's one goal after another. A highly impressive performance. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. And now the delivery. Well, not the best clearance. And the counter looks on here. Options available. All hands on deck. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Can he finish this? Well, given the position he found himself in, he really should be testing the keeper. Superb opportunity squander. the final whistle the home fans are jubilant they are going through well it was all at a bit of a canter to be honest they dominated pretty much from the start and it left the result in little doubt they'll be full of confidence going into the next round well it's normal to have high expectations where Angel is concerned Stuart what did you make of the part he played well it's a good performance he worked hard played well and scored a goal and his team won what more could you ask for